In the latest subtitle edit 3.6.7, it's possible to use the audio to text feature for selected lines. Now, the use case scenario is if maybe you think there's a mistake uh, in that particular section, but let's see how it works. So, I already have subtitle edit 3.6.7 downloaded and installed on my computer. You can also do that from the links below. So let's go to video, open video file, and then select the video that you want. And now I want to recreate a scenario where I already have the subtitles in. So go to file, open keep video, and then you can just select uh, whatever file you want. So let's go with this one. This one is an English file. And since we're going to be using the automatic transcription feature inside subtitle edit, and you can see it from video, it's right here, the audio to text, then you'll need to use that. Now, you may need to download a couple of things. So if I click on video, audio to text, you'll see that uh, you may need to download uh, VOSK models. Uh, and it's usually a step by step process. I do have a video on that, that you can check out. And then you download the models that is the different language models available here. I have the small English version. And you can click on this to download more if you're working on different language uh, subtitles and you want to use the audio to text feature in subtitle edit now let's close all this out because what we want to do is we want to select a couple of lines from this section and then have the view sky models and the uh, language packs do its thing so i'll just click on let's say we assume this like two lines or three lines have an issue so when you select those three lines, click on one and then press on shift, click on the last one that you want, and then just right click. Once you right click, navigate to selected line section here. And once you're here, just go to the audio option here and then click on audio to text. I'll click on that now. And once I do that, uh, the audio to text dialog box is going to pop up what I just walked you through from this particular section. Now, once you do that, what happens is that uh, you can now choose the model that you want i'll go with this one because it's the only one installed and the transcript is in english and then you may need to check this particular checkbox to use post processing that is the line merge fix casing punctuation and more of those features that might be automatically added now what happens is that in my own assumption is that uh, subtitle edit because it has ffmpeg it subdivides your audio into three for the three lines selected so that it can automatically transcribe based on that. Now, let's click on generate. If you're satisfied with all this, once you do that, it's going to load the Vosco models. And it's going to start transcribing audio to text. File one of three, and then it's going to go two of three, and then we're going to have three of three in just a bit. Now. Uh, it seems uh, like a little bit of intensive process, but once it's done, you'll get your updates here. So you'll see that if I just double click on this, you see what happens is that uh, it subdivides uh, all this into different lines. Now, probably that's one of the downsides of these VOSC models. It would be important if you can actually set the number of characters we might need per line uh, in this particular section, because what it does, it breaks up everything i believe probably based on different parameters inside subtitle edit so you can see that there are a couple of things that you may need to tidy up maybe uh, select and do the unbreak whatever so that you can now make the breaks yourself uh, uh, that works the same for this and then you can now make the different edits as you listen uh, to this particular section but if all you wanted was to have the selected lines that probably have an issue uh, change into something like uh, for you to use the audio to text feature. That is how you select the lines and how you can use the audio to text feature for selected lines. I hope this video tutorial is of value to you. Thank you so much for watching.